Hi guys, so today we will be solving an equation. Here is the problem. Find x. x minus 4 over 2022 plus x minus 3 over 2023 plus x minus 2 over 2024 equals 3. So basically, using the concept of LCD will be very difficult. So instead, use this trick. Okay? So first, to solve this equation, we will equate this equation to 0. So we can do that by subtracting both sides by 3, okay? So we have x minus 4 over 2022 plus x minus 3 over 2023 plus x minus 2 over 2024 minus 3 equals 3 minus 3. So that is 0, right? 3 minus 3. So the right side is equal to 0. Now, this minus 3 must be distributed for each term. So that is minus 1 for every term, right? So we need to subtract this first term by 1. So minus 1 here. For the second term, we have minus 1. And for the last term, minus 1. Okay? And everything is equal to 0. Now, let us simplify each term. So this uh, x minus 4 over 2022 minus 1 can be written as x minus 4 minus 2022 over 2022, right? Because 1 can be expressed as 2022 over 2022, right? Now, they have the same denominator, so we can... Uh, write this uh, expression as this one. So we have x minus 3 minus 2023, right, over 2023 plus x minus 2 minus 2024 over 2024, and everything is equal to 0. Now, let us simplify the numerators for every term. So we have x minus 2026 over 2022 plus x minus 2026 over 2023 plus x minus 2026 over 2024 equals 0. Now, each term has x minus 20, 26, right? So we can factor this out. So we have x minus 2026 times, okay? For the first term, we have 1 over 2022, and for the second, we have 1 over 2023, plus this, the last term would be 1 over 2024, and everything is equal to 0. Now, using the zero product property, either this first factor or the other factor is equal to 0, okay? So basically, uh, this second factor cannot be equal to zero. So that is greater than zero, in fact. So we can cancel this out. And, of course, this x minus 20, 26 is equated to zero. Okay? So solving for x, we have 2026. So the value of x that will satisfy this equation is 2026. Okay?